You look at dots, individual happenings, they look a certain way, but you start to connect them and you see the pattern. President Kennedy and Governor John Connolly have been cut down by assassin's bullets in downtown Dallas. A plane has crashed into one of the towers. Diana, Princess of Wales, has been killed in a car accident. Assassinations are not just made to happen, they have to be allowed to happen. What do you think happened with Kennedy? He was taken out for a number of reasons. One of them was that he wasn't keen on going into the full-blown Vietnam War. If you said to most people, it still is most people, how many buildings came down on 9-11? They'd say two. Go on the internet and you put in Building 7, collapse or whatever. You will see the most obvious controlled demolition you'll ever see. There's some people who think that they were drones. Oh, absolutely. Oh, God, yes. There were 84 cameras in and around the Pentagon, which we've never seen. The Princess Diana Death. You alluded to the fact that you thought she was murdered. She knew literally and symbolically where the bodies were buried for a start and she was becoming bigger than the royal family and and I, I go back to it she knew their secrets the police knew about Savile they knew what he was doing but for some reason he wasn't nailed and he wasn't nailed because he was a procurer of children for the rich and famous and therefore his back was watched and he stayed in the inner circle of the British royal family all the way through almost to the end of his life the world is controlled by basically a spider's web the cement that holds this web together is pedophilia and Satanism.